smoke some more fish. We're gonna mesquite smoke some salmon or salmon, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, it's gonna be a meal for one, so it's not gonna take very long. But uh, let's get it going. All right, folks. So here's what I'm gonna be doing. Got my salmon fillets. Like I was saying, it's not gonna be a very big meal, but I'm going to marinate them, soak them in some mandarin juice uh, for probably about 30 minutes. These are nice little fillets though. And uh, then we're gonna get the smokers going, the grill. We're gonna season these up, throw them on there and smoke them. And then we're gonna put that on top of some garlic butter noodles. All right, hang tight. Okie dokie, so here's what we're using for charcoal. Mesquite infused Kingsford and some mesquite wood chips. We're gonna get it really mesquite. All right. Yeah, okay, charcoals are smoking. Getting close. Oh yeah, all right. All right, everyone. Our salmon uh, fillets have been soaking in that mandarin juice for at least a good 35 40 minutes. Yep, all right. So we're gonna put them on our little grilling mesh. I'll put doing it like this because I'm gonna season the, uh, the skin side first because that's the one that's gonna be facing down. All right, let's get these seasoned up. All right. All right. We've got both sides seasoned. We need some black pepper, some red lobster seafood seasoning, some garlic powder, uh, onion powder, and some tahini. And uh, yep, let's get them on there and get them started smoking with that mesquite. Also, I'm gonna slice up some more mandarins and uh, just smoke them by themselves. Uh, that'll be great too. All right, hang tight. All right, folks, and there they are, seasoned on the grill. We're gonna do it in direct heat, which is beside the coals, off to the side, opposite coals. And like I was saying too, this will be good. Sliced up some of these, some of the mandarins. We're just gonna put them on there and smoke them too. Cause uh, that always turns out good actually. Grilled fruit is good in general. So we're just gonna set these accordingly, it don't matter, just whichever way. Put one up there. All right. And these little jewels, like I showed you before with the lemons and the trout, I'll show you what we'll do with those here in a little bit. Let me get the coals in there and get the smoke going. All right, this is going to be good. Hang tight. All right, here we go. Coals are going in. I will have to adjust all that. But also, I moved that one mandarin from over there to over there because it looks just looks better that way. All right, now we're going to spread those out a little bit. Throw some wood chips on there. And uh oh, wait a minute. Yep. I know it. Okie dokie. So let's get these over here and kind of maneuver around a little bit. Spread that out just a little bit. Not a whole lot. Get over here. Uh huh. Okie dokie. Now, let's go with our first handful of wood chips. And they got some mesquite going on. Oh yeah, you can already smell that. That's some powerful stuff. Of course, those uh, charcoal briquettes was already infused with mesquite, but all right. And the start uh, the first one here these little things the end caps and whatever like I did with the uh, smoked trout with the lemon just throw one on the top 
put a couple around and infuse that smoke with some mandarin. Yeah, just like that. Let those go for a minute. Get some smoke generating. And this is an offside smoker, but since uh, those are so thin and small cuts of fish, this won't take very long. And uh, of course, it's kind of cold out, but I don't want the fire way over here. You know what I'm saying? All right, hang tight. All right, so now it's been about 20 minutes into it. <laughs> And it's about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, and it looks like something's rolling in as far as weather-wise, because, of course, the wind's blowing pretty good. So what I'm going to do, uh, that's actually looking pretty good. I'm going to just take a couple of these little briquettes, just, just a couple, and put them over underneath there, just to help increase the heat factor on that side. Right, not, not many, just, just a couple. Yeah, all right. Let those uh, get some air to them there so they'll start back up a little bit. But yeah, it's looking pretty good. Now, it's only been about 20 minutes, 20, 25 minutes. Here shortly, I'm going to take this whole thing and rotate it and just probably do that uh, every so often so each side won't get more done than the other. But anyway, okay, hang tight. All right, now we're at about 30 minutes. We're not taking real long. I mean, we're going short strokes here. All right, that's looking pretty good. So, let's see here. I'm going to flip, rotate this around. All right, fire protection. But, uh, all right. Mm-hmm. Look pretty good. Smells great. I mean, mmm, dang gum. Woo. Oh, yeah. All right. It's going to be good. Okie dokie. Let's take a look. We're about 30, maybe 38 minutes into it. Oh, yeah. That's looking nice. Yes, indeed. Now I've turned it around. The whole thing. Put some more mesquite wood chips on there. And uh, yeah, all right. Shouldn't be too much longer. Like I said, 30, about 40 minutes almost into it now. But uh, that wind is blowing so f hard today that it's hard to keep a accurate heat inside there. Uh, I may add a couple more coals like I did earlier from there to there. Just a couple underneath there to help. Yep, whatever. But anyway, hang tight. All right, so about 40 minutes or so into this, what I'm gonna do, oh yeah, it's looking nice. The last ingredient is some soy sauce. I'm not gonna heavy do it. I'm just gonna put little drops here and there, you know. It's kind of hard to do that, see. So. Mm -hmm. I'm even gonna put some on the mandarin. Yeah. Mm. Woo. Telling you what. Close this back down. Let it go. So about 45 minutes into it, just a few minutes ago, I uh, added some soy sauce to everything. Well, just now, I opened it back up, spread out my coals a little bit, kind of dusted off that coating that uh, they're glowing in the center, but it's charcoal on the outside, you know what I'm saying? Added some more uh, mesquite wood chips, let that air uh, get to it so they'll catch on a little bit. We're going to close it back down and finish this off. Oh, yeah. Woo! Hey! Alright. Okay, and here we go. That's some ramen noodles that I just made. 
and we're gonna put some butter, some garlic, some onion powder, and the chicken flavor packet in there. Shake it all up, and then we're gonna put that smoked salmon on top of that. Oh yeah, very simple. All right, so now we have all that mixed in with these noodles, just some ramen noodles, and we did put the chicken flavored uh, flavor packet in there. We're just gonna shake it, shake it, shake it. Yeah, mix it all up. Uh huh. And we're about to put that uh, mesquite smoked salmon on top of that. Hang tight. All right. There's the finished product on that. Here's our noodles: garlic, onion, butter, just ramen noodles. With, even with a uh, flavor packet. Right. Spread that out. And something's going on. There's always something going on in this town. <laughs> but, uh, uh, I guess that's just the way it is. But, uh, yeah. Let's check this out here. We'll get uh, a couple of these on there. Mmm. Oh, that skin. Of course, you know, fish skin and something else. But, uh, we'll get these on there. Oh, yeah. It left the skin right on there, didn't it? Mmm. Still gonna be good. It's alright. That's got a thin skin. Good already. Oh my gosh, I'm mighty. Not even playing around. So then what we're gonna do? We're gonna take some of these grilled smoked mandarin slices. Put them on top of there. Now I did drizzle those uh, with a little bit of soy sauce. Didn't put no spices on them or anything. But man, those things are Got their own sweeteners in them. It's sticky. Woo. Isn't that something? Awesome. It's going to be good. Yeah. How many are you going to put on there? Well, I don't know. A bunch. it off sliced up another fresh mandarin and we're just gonna squeeze the juice all across the top of it just like that mm. Ooh -wee. that's what I'm talking about mm. yep smoked mandarin salmon on some garlic butter noodles Ooh -wee. If you like my channel please subscribe hit the like button hit that bell notification thing that way each time I come out with something new you'll be notified yeah those little skins stuck to that didn't they hmm that's all right still gonna be wonderful all right till the next cooking adventure or any kind of adventure go outdoors have some fun do some cooking write a song I don't know till next time Peace out. Enjoy life.